And we had this kind of celebration here today, the unveiling of the Nigerian team. It has not been like this over the years, but this time around we have seen them, um, you know, something like this. Yes, uh, my name is, first of all, my name is Lorita Onye, uh, the Paralympic uh, gold medalist. Okay. Awesome. So um, I'm happy, I'm excited for being among the people that make the team. Uh, because this is my third time I've been, uh, this is my third time Paralympic game. On assembly, so Paris 2024. So I'm very, very happy to be among them as we gather here to celebrate. Be happy to for the minister to cheer us up, know, to encourage us, you know, and be happy with us. We are, we are happy. I'm happy. I'm excited. No, you, you, you've been to uh, two uh, Paralympics. Yes. Uh, what do you want um, the government to do for you differently this time around? You've had a lot of experiences uh, back then. So what do you want them to do differently from you this time? Like we have been representing Nigeria since 17 years and uh, I've never achieved what something that is tangible from my country like uh, uh, like people like us uh, our, our, that let me, our government to uh, uh, employ us by you know be, be not be not put us in payroll with the uh, with, with the Paralympians or Paralympians or just Olympic uh, athletes we have to be on payroll since we are representing the country you know, like some of that of my uh, counterparts, like uh, my opponents, that the other country, they, uh, their, their government employ them. They are on payroll. Understand? So we have to be on payroll because this competition is every four, four years. For how many four years I've never been competing? Since I, uh, my competition was this year for me to qualify for this uh, Paris 2024. So I've not been competing. This another one we come after another four years. Four, 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 four years. How am I coping? How am I going? How am I taking care of myself? How am I. Uh, you know, packaging myself, doing training, uh, feeding, and doing some other pills. As soon as uh, I think they have to be put us in on payroll. And again, uh, as we're going to, they have to give us a tangible award, not by giving us some of this money. Uh, they say, let you give us a like, accommodation. Eh? It's money that we used to pay our accommodation. We need to have accommodation, not only footballers. Whatever you do for uh, this, uh, you have to do it for good uh, B. We are all the same, we have the same energy. Uh, it's energy. After all, it's a team. But this one, it's only me that will fight and I will get a gold. But this one is a team. I still give them something one one. Teamwork will give them something good. That is life. But we, we nothing like life, like accommodation, like uh, just something like that for us. When we go Olympic and come back, it, it looks like nothing happened. They just uh, abandon us. We are just used and, and, and dump. And after this Olympic, now we, and another one is next four years. We will not be talking about, we will not, we will not be support, they will not be supporting us. They are nothing like supportive to us, we athletes, mostly we Paralympians, paraathletes. Like people like us, we cannot be employed being a force, being armed force or whatever. We only feed on, on being a sports person. And I can't be doing sports and be doing some other, some other business, not possible, and I cannot make the team. If I'm doing, uh, maybe I, I want to train and come back, I'm not going to say, I can't, I can't be able to come the next day. Sports is a business. In other countries, sports is a business. It's a business whereby I'm doing it and I'm making my country proud. For many times, not day I went to competition, I come back with empty handed. But my country are not making, making us proud. They other than being a disgrace, you understand me? Imagine that I went to competition in Tokyo 2020, I competed. Being on fish because they, they, they uh, provide my real side or the, 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 stand, the true standard for me to compete. I competed on feet, which made me to one bronze, if not God. So, my country, what they are doing, the way they are treating athletes, is like they are sort of making up in 
going back to be a beggar. Like I'm, a, I'm working hard. I'm not. I'm, I'm working hard. You don't have to put me in a place that whereby anybody, whoever, whoever that sees me, I say I'll be proud of myself. Being that my government is trying, not that after I complete, I'm being a world champion. Being they advertise me all over the world. The people thinking that I'm rich, I'm have money. They don't need that. My my account is is is, is empty. Okay, right it's now, an embarrassment. Right, right now, that has been resolved now. Um, in terms of the equipment, you already have um, your right kittens and all of that. Uh, bronze is what of what you got uh, that last, uh, in, uh, in, in, in Tokyo. Yes. yes. Uh, I, I mean, in Rio, you got... Um, what did you get in Rio? Bronze. Bronze. Because of uh, I was disqualified with my, the shoe I wore, it's, they, they said it's too high. That's not the proper okay, shoe. So, I so your, your, your expectations, I mean, now, um, are you assuring Nigerians that you're going to get... Um, what color of medal are you going to give Nigerians this time? See, any medal, I medal. To win a gold medal for for Olympic is not uh, easy. <laughs> medal, I medal, it's not easy. If you be number one, it's not easy. If you be number two, it's not easy. If you be number three, it's not easy. I am not showing anybody. Nigeria are not showing me for anything. At Nigeria, they showing me for anything. So whatever I provide is what I can provide. I can't assure you that I'm not a politician. <laughs> but you are going to get the medal, right? But you wish to get the medal. By the special grace of God, it shall allow. Thank yes. you very much. Yeah, welcome. Much.